A simple handful marks the beginning of something very complicated, where a body of motion begins to bond with a vertical wall. The flow, rhythmic and delicate, knee bar, that at times crescendos into a powerful 20-foot leap at 45 degrees. 18-year-old Joe Diaz feels quite comfortable spending his life literally just hanging around. Keep that snug. I tend to be pretty calm on the wall. In fact, that's exactly where he wanted us to interview him. I got into it about 10 years ago. Under clean. It started with doing birthday parties. It was one birthday. I made it up halfway. That was actually pretty good compared to the rest of the kids. This is hard. So I thought this would be pretty fun to do regularly. That's a spinner. So I got into it. Okay. And in 10 years, Joe Diaz has gotten so good, this is considered easy. Just watch as Diaz quickly scales the 35-foot high arch. Da, 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 da. And then listen in as he methodically performs a hey. difficult move. Hey, knee bar. While upside down. That's hard. Another knee bar. All to take a selfie. Upside down. With our GoPro camera. Oh, oh gosh, that's hard. Oh, this is, this is a very painful knee bar. It's a sport that plays with your head and plays with your body. Lance sees already, calls Diaz an athlete who has honed his natural climbing ability, making difficult moves look easy. I call it grace in action. The moves look effortless, and it's from years of training. It's from years of knowing that particular hold of how to grab it, how to pull on it, and knowing your body. Damn. Really knowing your body. And, and with that knowledge, Diaz has won competition after competition. Yes! including a silver medal at the 2015 U.S. Nationals. That means I'm second in the nation and I've qualified for the U.S. climbing team. He has now earned a chance to compete in Arco Italy at the World Championships in August. Back on the wall where he feels the most comfortable, just hanging around. In Rancho Cordova, Brian Yamamoto, News 10.